this bottle of Puro is, is the only wine in the world, it's sparkling wine in the world, sold with the sediment in it. And the, uh, the idea is behind this wine, and, and you, you disgorge it into a clear bottle, clear uh, basin of water like this. But the reason why he does it is because he's got um, these Pinot Noir vines it's from Slovenia. So Pinot Noir vines that uh, ripen too much. He doesn't want to use sulfur, he doesn't want to add sugar. What, does, what can he do? So he stops the fermentation um, before he stops the fermentation before it's completely finished. He bottles it and then restarts the fermentation inside the bottle. That leaves him with some sediment. Now he doesn't want to add sugar. If he doesn't, but he also knows that if you don't add sugar, and certainly if you don't add sugar and SO2, that the, the wine will quickly just go very, very oxidated, very coarse and not very. So what does he do? He thinks, well, I'll leave the sediment in the bottle and I'll get the poor sommelier to open everyone into a, into a bottle of water. Now, so he sells these magnums and he makes them keep these magnums this way up. And this magnum apparently for a couple of weeks has been this way up until somebody somewhere here decided Oh, it's the wrong way up. <laughs> Turn it back the other way. And we've been trying to coax the uh, sediment back down to the bottom, but really, you know, for something that should take several days or a couple of weeks at best, um, to try and do it in a few minutes is, is a little bit difficult. So I'm not sure that it's going. To, what normally happens is that when you, it's a rose, when you undo this um, cork and take it out, it should explode like an explosion of pink. Um, gunge into the water and it looks really quite dramatic. You can go on to, if this doesn't work, you can go on to YouTube and see somebody doing it and, and doing it properly. Um, he, he gets the, I, th I thought, how can you sell a bottle full of sediment, uh, charge a lot of money and then make him keep it upside down and then make him open it, you know, in front of the customer. You, this, this, just, this is just not viable, this is not commercial. You go, they're queuing up. Somalians are these biggest actors in the world. They love to perform. Um, and so he, he's, he's got this remarkable um, uh, business going. He's got this, he normally comes in a, a big round um, glass bowl that he supplies them and, a, and a, a tire arm that fits over the, of this so he can just do that with it, but uh, I don't have the tire iron, and we don't have the proper bowl, so I hope this will work. You've got to, you've got to have just the right amount of time to get it. Right. Okay. Over now.